All right, more misery. And uh, when I left off last time, I got killed by that zombie that I hit about a hundred thousand times with my knife, and it did not die. And I had no idea why that was the case at the time, but I I think I saw it on uh, I think it was a comment section on the mod DB page a while ago. And it was for the patch 1.1 update. Apparently, they reduced the uh, the hit damage of the knife uh, to something under a nine millimeter uh, pistol bullet, something like that. And uh, I think I've got all these radio parts or uh, whatever they are for nitro. So I'm gonna try to head back there, but I'm gonna have to score a headshot on this guy when I see him. And I'm not sure when that's gonna be. Did I... No, I didn't. Yeah, there it is. Okay. I guess I hadn't quick saved for a little bit there, so... I had to go grab the last radio part. Oh, is that him? I want to get rid of the zombie. He's concerning me a little bit here. Did he already come? Oh, okay. And these things in this mod are just tanks. They can soak up so much damage unless you do a, a headshot. Then it's a big waste of bullets to try and kill them. I wish I knew where this one was. Where did he... Try to just make it across here and get on this roof maybe. This is a decent vantage point here. Oh, there he is. Okay, so let's wait for... Where'd he go? Oh, okay, I have an idea. Quick save in case this backfires horribly. <laughs> yes, this is gonna be perfect. What? Okay, I, I... Like I said, these things are tanks. No, don't... Get down and stay that way. Oh, I can hear those rats. If that's what they are. They changed the sound and I'm pretty certain that's what they are. And you can find them underground here. Oh, get out of the radiate. Come on. I don't need that. So what's this guy got? Ooh. Okay, am I... Of course the zombie had to run <laughs> walk right into that patch. Yeah, I'll take that. And yes, I do know now that that film grain effect on my screen is in fact or not film grain but that weird effect I was getting before is definitely the okay I'm gonna stop talking and just take this crap yeah that little screen effect is uh... happens when you drink the vodka so yeah and another thing I wanted to bring up too was um... You guys are constantly posting stash locations on my videos, and that's awesome. Uh, and I think I'm going to end up making a video later showcasing most of the stash locations that you have commented on. And f But for now, uh, I'm not too concerned about picking them up. And the reason is, I just, I usually, I usually try to find all the stashes, but you know, that's kind of... 
I, I wouldn't say it's cheating, but I don't want to just go and pick up every single stash in the game and have it easy. I do, I do want to have uh, the feeling of having to hunt for bullets and med kits and not being able to find stuff. That's, I don't know, that's just me, but thank you for all your uh, stash locations. I do appreciate them. I'm just not sure if I'll be going to pick up every one of them in this uh, in this playthrough, but I I still would like to be able to make a standalone video, maybe, of all the stash locations I've found, and then maybe load previous uh, saves and check out the ones that you've posted, because that's always helpful. So, quick save before I get shot. And what's going on with this? The screen's twitching, and I think it has something to do with this uh, drunk effect. And I'm not sure if these are zombies up here that are fighting, or if it's another freedom versus duty battle. But I do want in on some of the loot. Oh, okay. Yeah. What? Please don't shoot at me. I. Please. I didn't do anything. I'm looting these guys. Grenade, yes. 45 caliber rounds, yes. Sleeping bag, yes. What did this guy have on him? Didn't he have a primary here? I guess not. And I, I'm not super interested in picking up are you a hot? Please don't be hostile. Look at that. No gun. Yeah, you're not. Zombies don't loot. Everyone knows that. Grenade. I hope he didn't. Oh, that's what part of this was. I see. And I'm carrying way too much here. Yeah, let me just. I'll pick up everything and then. I'll sort it. And I don't want this guy to get too far away here, because I want to sell some stuff to him. Okay, what did I pick up? AK-105... AN-94... Yeah, that's not in great condition. I'm sure I can find one later that's in better condition than that. And this one's totally broken. Unload that, drop it, drop that. Because I, I don't think I'll be able to even sell this guy... Those. Yeah, what boss? I think he's dead. Yeah, super helpful there. Okay, so uh, forget what I said there. I guess I'm not selling anything. But I do want to go check this. I think it's called a, a bucket wheel excavator. I'm not entirely sure, but the thing's massive. They also featured one of these in um, Borderlands. I can't remember what what territory it was. The salt flats. I think that was it. What's going on here? Am I hungry? Hmm. Just don't go near the machinery because it's irradiated. Now get up on this. Oh come on! I always fall off this thing. This is worse than the oak pine. I swear. Like, look at that. Come on. Sort of gotta, like, hop your way up, I guess. Oh, do a low crouch. <laughs> Actually, I'm gonna quick save here just because I think a fall from this height might kill me. And in a couple seconds, I might be putting that to the test. Uh, come on. Yes. Perfect form. Yeah, I don't think there's any... Uh, I think there's an anomaly in this cab here. Just checking the top. I think there's a stash in here, though. Just take out my bolt. Yeah, there is a chemical. Yeah, 
Ooh, what do we have? Nice. So this is, uh, I guess, the second part of... Holy crap, look at this. Wow. Ghost was generous. <laughs> oh, this is nice. And I got a Fort 12 here. Nice. This is what I'm talking about. And that is not what I'm talking about with the weight. MP... These are really common amongst the, the zombies, I think, so... I'll stash it on his body and, uh... Take it back later, and I... Oh, decisions. I want all of this stuff, but... Man, I cannot carry all of it. I just can't. Oh, I got a crap load of these, uh... Five, four, five rounds. I'll, I'll try to tough it out. But if I keep, you know, like just falling over because I'm so tired from all this stuff, then yeah, which looks like it's going to be the case. Uh you know what? The, the AK-105. Come on, let me in. Let me in. There we go. That's getting stashed. How much do these weigh? 0.75? Yes. Stash both of those. <laughs> what? I didn't hurt myself. Why did there just random blood spatter there? Okay. And I might... So... Oh. Okay, how do I get off of here now? Oh. Okay. It would seem like I... Come on, get up there. Yeah, I guess I gotta, gotta go up this way. Another thing I'm unsure about is... Uh, Iggy Hazard actually posted... Uh, he's been watching my videos, which is pretty awesome. He's probably the main reason why I actually started making these. And uh, he's been commenting like crazy on my videos. And his last one said... If you take three of the antibiotics, you'll get an achievement and you'll be able to survive blowouts as long as you have full health when they hit. Now, I, I don't know if anyone's tried this so far in this mod, but I'm not sure if that's the case just because of uh, the difficulty increase. So I'd be really interested to find out, because that would be useful even though... Oh God. Even though I'm never usually at full health, that would still be a really useful thing to have. Can I make it across this wire? Is this even possible? Oh, jeez. Okay, I'm falling off. Falling off, don't let me fall off. I can get down this way, I think. I'm, I might just be being totally stupid here and not thinking. Which is probably the case. Oh, come on. This is like a tight rope. Don't fall. Don't fall. doesn't help that it's pretty much not oh yes there's the ladder is that a ladder can I climb this ladder I I wouldn't be surprised if no is the answer here can I shimmy down this thing or am I oh god oh no this does not look good no 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 no, stay on it, stay on it. Oh, look at that. I'm... I'm surfing on this thing. That was pretty awesome. Do some uh, parkour here. No, no, don't fall. Don't fall, please. Come on. Why can't I jump this? There we go. Now this looks like another good place for a stash, but I'm not sure if there's anything over here. Just not sure. Where can I get down? Oh. Looks like this might have been the way to go, actually. Come on, get down there. 
Can I just get off of this thing, please? So let me just check around here. There might be something good in here. Yeah, this is the way off. Or a way off, it looks like. I doubt that's actually how you're supposed to do it, but I got off. <laughs> and I'm... <sighs> Am I tired? Am I really, really tired or something? I gotta get back to that. Let me check my status here. See if this does anything. Not really, and that's... Big chemical hazard there. <laughs> um, a couple artifacts I want. I, I need a jellyfish, because... It's just gonna waste more... Uh, more anti-rads when I just run into a little patch of radiation that I can't get rid of. And there's one in the claw anomaly, I know that, but I, I just I couldn't check it out at the time. But I am... I'm just gonna go back to the station and get some sleep. Sleep till morning, at least. If this is even night. Yeah, it's, it's getting dark. And it's stormy. But I've got some good stuff. Some very good stuff. And hopefully uh, Nitro will pay me well for my troubles getting him those tools. Not tools. Supplies, I guess you'd call them. Soldering supplies. Ooh. Bit of a hiccup there. It seems, uh, especially in people's soup, that whenever there's um, AI loading, so any kind of mutants or NPCs, it does the hiccup. Like it just it stutters for a couple seconds to load them in. It seems like, and it's kind of a giveaway when uh, you're walking up to a place and you s you just the game kind of hiccups a little bit on you, and you know there's going to be something around there. So. I think that was something that uh, was going to be at least lessened in in a patch from Techno Bacon sometime, but I don't know, not really a huge issue right now. But uh, going to go down to my personal box. Actually, first, first and foremost, get more health from this guy. Yeah, fix me. What do you have? I don't. I don't actually need anything from this guy. I've got Woods that off. I've got a lot of stuff. Med kits, bandages, all sorts of good no stuff. And I, I think I'm gonna do his mission. Just because uh you know it's a good way of getting a bunch of loot. Not that I, I really am keen on siding in the whole duty versus freedom here. I'm not I usually keep that neutral. But you know, maybe this time I will side with one of them, but... Where am I going? I'm going to see... Where's Nitro? Getting turned around. Here it is. Yeah. Oh, привет. Searched and found the materials for it. Yes! Free labor on all repairs and upgrades. Did I? Okay, hold on. Is he really going to do this stuff for free? Like, seriously? Oh, no. Wishful thinking there, right? Yeah. Yeah, I'll give you free repairs and upgrades. Best prices pot. Well, at least he's going to give me some kind of a discount. How much is this going to cost? 500. It's not. It's fine. It doesn't need that. Honestly, it doesn't. What I would like 
is to see how much it's going to cost to get that F2000 repaired. Because I'm, I'm going to sell that thing instantly. No, no, just kidding. Just kidding, I'm not going to sell it. No, I wouldn't sell that. It's too good. 